That sounds ridiculous. This car just uh, at certain points wants to try and kill you. But it's Barney here back at it with another video and welcome back to Proving Auto. So today guys I'm going to be bringing you a POV drive of my M240i. A few people seem to be doing videos like this so uh, I thought I'm going to jump on the bandwagon myself because uh, yeah it is an awesome bit of kit. Now of course for regular viewers of my channel you will probably know this car nearly inside out by now uh, but for people who are new uh, let me just do a quick little walk around of the car. So yeah as I say this is my F22 BMW M240i uh, which I've owned for about about seven eight months now and uh, covered about 6,000 miles. Absolutely loving the car. Yes it is totally standard at the minute. The only uh, thing I've done so far is the um, GPF or OPF delete uh, which also deletes out the resonator as well. It's now sounding exactly how it should have done out of the factory which you will of course hear when we get out on the road. But yes, uh, it's finished in, I think it's either Alpine white or mineral white they call it, I'm not too, it's either one or the other, I can't exactly remember uh, which colour it is. But yeah, looking absolutely fantastic. I have actually just cleaned it today as well, uh, hence why it's looking super glossy. Uh, also uh, having the uh, G-Technic uh, ceramic coating on as well, that also does help the paintwork. Honestly looking really really fantastic. So yeah uh, now a little bit of an apology to make because uh, I was actually intending to uh, record this video uh, a little bit uh, sooner in the day uh, however uh, due to me cleaning the car I had a few bits on this morning as well uh, so yeah it's going to be a bit of a dusk POV drive so uh, yeah uh, chances are I will also do uh, another one of these uh, videos as well uh, when it's a little bit lighter and of course once I've got a few more modifications on the car. Now of course if you want to see my future plans for the car now would be an absolutely perfect time to hit that subscribe button. Uh, it's totally free, costs you absolutely nothing and of course uh, really does help the channel along. Of course it'll only take two seconds of your time and you can of course change your mind at any time. Okay so wasting no more time let's jump into the car, let's head into the countryside and let's go and have a bit of fun. Now this shot might look a little bit weird because I did actually attempt to record this video a few days ago but um, unfortunately on the drive itself I noticed that the camera angle was a little bit off to the point where I thought you know what I'm gonna have to just scrap uh, that part of the video and start again. <laughs> so yeah this, this video is actually uh, turning out to be a bit of a nightmare to make. But uh, anyway, so yeah, I've just basically just come back up here today just to uh, re-record this part of the video. Uh, so yeah, I, don't, I really don't know how this is actually going to turn out. So let's, um, let's mute that before I get a copyright claim. Uh, one thing I've actually noticed with this car is that um, it always seems to go through, no matter how warm or cold the car is, it always seems to go through a cold start cycle so uh, every time you start it the revs always start like it's uh, sitting at about a thousand uh, revs at the minute um, I mean that is very slowly going down so uh, yeah I always find that always strange you can get it mapped out which I'm actually going to do uh, along the line I'm going to turn DSC off and um, just before we get going I'll just give the car a little bit of revs <laughs> So yeah, <laughs> doesn't sound too bad. Uh, the videos never actually do the exhaust justice. Uh, shall we turn, yeah, we'll leave the SC off for now. I'll probably put it in Sport Plus. Now, I'm gonna try and keep talking to a minimum just because uh, I think you guys obviously just want to see the driving. Everyone's probably looking at me thinking, what a knob. <laughs> So yeah, I hope, that, I hope the camera angle's looking okay, I hope it's not too low or high. I will actually probably do another video like this along the line once I've actually 
done a few more bits to the car and also when it's a little bit lighter as well. So yeah, uh, as I say, I don't know how well this is going to turn out, so I hope, I hope it's okay. It doesn't help that I'm tall as well. The, every time I turn my head, uh, the GoPro seems to keep hitting the roof. And of course, because I can't see the screen, so I've no idea what it actually looks like. I'll give, I'll give it a best shot. I'll put the windows down a bit so you guys can, uh, we'll try and get a little bit of noise out of it. I'm going to put the gearbox into sport. Yeah, I'll probably leave it in, uh, I'll probably leave it with DSC off for now because that uh, has proven so far, that seems to be the loudest mode. Yeah, the sun is actually going down as well, so fingers crossed we can uh, catch a decent sunset as well, hopefully. Ah, these roadworks weren't here the other day. Go on then, pal. It's green. But yeah, I'm absolutely loving this car. Anyway, as I say, I've only for about um, I've only for about eight months now, and. Um, it's just, I'm just at the stage with it where I don't think, I still haven't actually got bored with it ever since, uh, ever since I've got it back in May, May last year. No, May, April? No, yeah, April, sorry. I'm going to go into, I think I'm going to put it in Sport Plus. I'll put Sport Displays on as well. Uh, now, funny enough, um, now I'm actually going to cover this in a separate video, uh, but the Sport Displays, which displays your horsepower and torque and all of that, uh, when you put the car into Sport or Sport Plus. Um, now, funny enough, you can actually change the colour of that from orange to red if you use um, Carly, uh, which I'm going to, I think I'm going to sort at some point. As I say, I'll cover that, I'll, I will cover that in a separate video. I don't know when that's going to go live, but it'll go, it'll go live at some point in the not too distant future. I've actually managed to pick another dry day to do this. Um, Unfortunately, we are stuck behind. I mean, it's not it doesn't really make, make much difference at the minute uh, because it is a 40 mile an hour road. Um, but we do seem to be stuck behind this uh, Ford, which is a bit unfortunate. But hey ho! Oh man, what road works again? This is just a time of year, isn't it, where they just seem the time of year where they just seem to just dig up everywhere and just do it all at exactly the same time. But. Uh, Hey ho, what can you do? Right, I'll tell you what, you know what, I might just cut this next bit out and then just uh, cut to a point where we can have a bit more fun. Out there. The, way, the way this thing just picks up is just unbelievable. Like the power delivery is just so smooth. Okay, we've got a bit of a acceleration opportunity coming up now, and a good few corners as well. Didn't get that from the golf car. I'm sure this car just uh, at certain points wants to try and kill you. But what actually what I do like with Sport Plus um, is that it does actually turn traction control off to a degree, um, but still lets you have. It doesn't turn it fully off, um, 
but still let's have a still let's you kick the back end out and have a little bit of have a little bit of fun still okay so uh slow down a little bit more now as we're going through this little village see how much we can annoy the locals with the exhaust Love the sound of this thing, I really do. B50, the B58 engine just sounds, uh, it's, a, it's a lovely sounding engine anyway, um, but then add that and the exhaust as well. Just such a great combination, such an awesome combination. Good few corners here. <laughs> Not difficult to drive this car on the limit at all. It really isn't. Oh, that sounds ridiculous. <laughs> The amazing thing as well is that it's uh, it's just running a standard map. You know, I mean the way the way it picks up, the way it sounds. You know, actually getting rid of the you know getting rid of the resonator and the GPF is just it just completely enhances the sound of the car. And you get rid of one, then you get another. <laughs> well, that's the way it goes sometimes, though. No, he's turned off now anyway, as it turns out. <laughs> anyway, I'm going to be turning off in a second, as long as he's not going the same way. He's not perfect, and I think that is a... Ooh, got in front of him just at the right time. Clear road, but a bit bumpy, so got to be a little bit careful down here. I always pick the best routes, don't I? <laughs> great fun, though. Really, really great fun. So uh, up here, I know, is a decent little lay-by, a little bit of a car park as well next to it. So uh, I think I'm going to pull in there, and I guess wrap up today's video because it is getting uh, it's getting a bit getting a bit dark now. So yeah, as I say, I'm not too sure how well this is going to turn out. I'm hoping it's turned out okay. And uh, yeah. Okay, well that, guys and girls, I think is where I'm going to wrap things up. The sun, I think, has just gone down over there, as we can see. Yeah, as I mentioned many, many times throughout the entire video, which I know I probably have. <laughs> yeah, absolutely loving this car. Absolutely can't get enough of the thing at the minute. And uh, of course, because we are, well, I've just been between Christmas and New Year, so I've actually been using it uh, more than what I normally would in the week. I don't normally drive it that much because I'm always in my work truck. <laughs> so uh, yeah, just been nice this week to uh, actually get a few miles in it and uh, just, just enjoy the car basically. So uh, yeah, if you guys want me to do more videos like this, do let me know. Uh, I do, as I say, I do plan to do more at some point. Uh, when I've uh, obviously tuned it and done a few little bits, I have actually got, uh, I do plan on replacing these, actually probably some carbon um, badges as well. Uh, I did actually reveal uh, my plans in the last video I uploaded, so uh, do by all means go and check it out if you wish. So yes, that's going to be it for me today, guys. If you've enjoyed the video, do give a thumbs up. It's always appreciated. Also, consider subscribing for more stuff like this in the future. And if you don't, do not forget to hit the bell icon. Turn on all notifications so you don't miss out on a single thing to come. Okay, so until next time, guys, thank you all so much for watching. Make sure you look after yourselves. Stay safe. 
and I will see you all very soon. Thank you.